Hello and a very warm welcome to Healing Hand Services. My name is Julie Sean and here we are today on Wednesday the 24th of February for the card for the day. The deck I am using is Healing with the Angels by Doreen Virtue and so without <clears throat> any more to do so I'm surrounded and we're connecting with our um, fairies our guides, our gods and our goddesses, so the masters, and there's a card that has come out already as I was talking, <laughs> don't you love it? Moving forward fearlessly. <gasps> Moving forward fearlessly. This is just going for it, going for it. When you feel fear, you've just, as you go, you go, oh, I feel fear. You know, you've got this energy, you're feeling this sensation within ourselves. And what we have done, we've got the sensation, it's in us and things. And what we've decided to do, or thanks to our ego, is this feeling that we go, we called it fear. And then we associate the word fear, oh, can't do it to fear, fear, fear. But if you call that sensation inside you as excitement, it's like, oh my God, I'm excited to move forward. So we have just named something or the, uh, negative connotation. So yes, it's good to have, you know, our, our instincts, our fear, you know, the fight or flight symptoms. Yes, you know, do we stay, stay and fight or do we run away and hide and then recover and then carry on? But this is saying moving forward fearlessly to actually step into your strength, step into yourself and go, I can do this. This is exciting. This is really brilliant and I can do it. And I'm stepping into uh, into my true worth, into my onto my true path of where I'm going. I can see she's stepping there. She is looking um, where she's going. Uh, she's having a. There is a water there. It's almost like she's looking down at herself. She's reflecting on herself, reflecting like, can I do this? Can I do this? Can I do this? Can I do that? But she's got all those beautiful fairies there going, yes, you can do it. You can do it. Reflect on how far you've come. How far have you come? Look what you've done. Look what your journey. Maybe, yes, your journey may have been hard. Maybe some days have been easy, but you've grown. And with the knowledge and the wisdom of your life experience that you have experienced up until this moment here and now has brought you to a place to go, yes, I am going to now move on. Why? Because you've got to a place and you've suddenly decided, yes, I can see my goal. I can see my dream. I can see where I want to go and I'm going to step into it. Or maybe you've been working on it and it's just like thinking, have I got there? Oh, I don't know. But then when you look back and realise how far you've come, it's free. And you just say, keep stepping forward, keep stepping forward. And when it's saying moving forward fearlessly, just going, I can do it. I am able to do this and stop listening to those negative words, i.e. the negative words of the, Deb, uh, of the Debbie Downers around it or the negative naysayers or stop listening to your ego who's saying they no, can't do this. But you've thought about where you are now. Where am I today? What am I doing? Something is not right inside you. You're thinking, is there something missing? Maybe you're thinking I'm not happy with my job. Maybe I'm not happy with my relationship. Maybe I'm not happy with my health. I'm not happy with my wealth. I'm not happy with my free time. I'm not happy. You know, you've, you've analysed your whole life. Maybe you're not happy where you're living. Maybe you're not happy in the home, in the town. I don't know. But you're just realising that something is not right. And you've decided that this is holding you back. And you're now deciding this is the time to look to see what is holding me back. What is stopping me from stepping into my true worth? What is stepping me, is stopping me from stepping into my true being? And then you're realising that actually it is your own true self lack of, can I do this? Can I do this? You know, and it's like you're scared. Because you're scared of the change. Humans hate change. Humans do not like change at all. It's against the thing. They like things to be there saying the same thing over and over and over and over because it's comfortable. And humans like comfort. And even if that's where you are in now is, is not perfect, you put up with it because it's what you know. 
you know, oh, well, you know, I have this routine, but, you know, don't, but, but, you know, I do this every day, I go to the hill. Every... And yes, you may not be happy about it, but it's a routine and you're comfortable and you know what's going to come next, you know, oh, I do this job and it's, I take the same journey, I do this and the same thing happens day after day after day. But you know what's going to come and it's comfortable. But it's when you suddenly go, would you like the job promotion? And it's like, oh. first of all, you go, oh, I don't think I can do that because, you know, you're having to step out of your comfort zone. And then it's like, I've got to do a different job. Do I, can I do this? Oh, my God, what if I fail? And then you get all these doubts and the fears stepping in. And so then you're just like, no, I'm going to do it. But it'd be nice to have the promotion or money. Yeah. Well, this card is telling us to moving forward fearlessly is to take out the opportunities we're given with both hands and going. So this is telling you. You are making breakthroughs in your life by putting your divine, divinely inspired ideas into action. Trust that you are guided each step of the way. Those gut feelings, your dreams and strong impulses you've been getting aren't just examples, examples of wishful thinking. They represent the germination of new projects and situations that are vehicles for your divine life mission. Don't ignore those gifts from heaven which come on the wings of repetitive strong thoughts and feelings. You know, you've known for ages, something's got to change. Why are you holding back? The fairies ask you to honour your inner feelings by taking at least one step today in the direction of making your dreams and desires a reality. Oh my God, this is exciting. Fearlessly take one step to dismantle any part of your life that is out of integrity. Take another step towards realising your heart's desire. Even a tiny step that is remotely related to improving your life will make you feel that you're soaring with the fairy realm. Keep taking one step a day and soon your dreams will be a reality. Exactly. It's time for action. This is a, 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 a movement card because this is moving forward fearlessly. We are moving. You've reflected. You've thought, I've got my dream. I want to do this. She's now stepping. Can you see? She's stepping. It's a movement card. It's an action card. And yes, you can have these dreams, but you can sit there and start thinking, oh, I've got this dream. I'd love to do this. I've got this dream. I'd love to do that. I'd like to have this. I'd like to have that. I'd like to have this home. I'd like to have this job. I'd like to have this money. I'd like to have this health. Blah, blah, blah. But this card is saying, now is the time to stop thinking, but start actioning. There's an affirmation here. I move forward fearlessly, trusting that each step I take is perfectly guided. Oh, yes. Your angels and your fairies and your guides and your sending masters and your elementals, they are not going to lead you into danger. They are leading you towards your life's goal, your life purpose, your dreams. And they're only here to let lift you and to share and guide and love you. But like I said, they are guiding. You are now listening. You are now acting. It is time to act. I move forward fearlessly, trusting that each step I take is perfectly guided. I move forward fearlessly, trusting that each step I take is perfectly guided. I move forward fearlessly, trusting that each step I take is perfectly guided. Thank you, fairies, for being with us today. Thank you, angels, guides and loved ones for being with us and giving us this guidance. We can do this. It's amazing. If you've enjoyed this reading, don't forget to press the subscribe button. If you'd like to book your own reading, message me and I'd love to do a reading for you. Have an amazing day connecting with the fairies. Take care. Namaste. Bye.